Hi, I'm Paul from Production Expert. In this series of videos, we're showing you how to record your first song in Universal Audio's Luna software. Now, in the first video, we set up the song. In the second video, we recorded a really rough guitar part just to build up the production. And in this video, what we're gonna be doing is to start adding some production by using some instruments. Luna is Universal Audio's fully featured DAW, which they're calling their recording system. Now, Luna gives Apollo owners the fastest recording environment for music production, editing, and mixing. In addition to its seamless hardware software integration with Thunderbolt equipped Apollo and Arrow interfaces, Luna Recording System allows capturing audio through DSP powered UAD plugins with no discernible latency, as well as offering new accelerated real time monitoring, which provides analog style tracking and overdubbing workflow using Apollo's onboard DSP acceleration. If you're used to using Pro Tools, a lot of the same key commands that are used in Pro Tools are used in Luna. So we're gonna set up a new track and the shortcut for that is Shift Command and N. Now on the left hand side, you'll see the Create New Tracks windows appeared. Now I'm gonna call this drums and we're gonna choose an instrument for this. We're gonna make it stereo and the instrument we're gonna choose for this is the default one that it comes up with, which is Shape. And let's choose OK. Shape has appeared on the desktop. Now Shape is a really fantastic sounding workstation type instrument. It contains everything you'll need to do your songwriting. So I'm gonna choose the presets button here and on the left hand side, all of my presets. Now I'm gonna be recording a really basic drum part just so I can build up the production. Let's just choose EDM pop kit just for the sake of this demo. Right, let's put it in record. And there's the sounds I'm gonna be using. So let's record a part. Now I just wanna make sure that the drums are quantized. So I'm gonna choose the little Q button up here and my quantize window appears. So I'm gonna highlight all of my drums and choose quantize. So let's top and tail this so I can copy this part across the whole song. Now if I wanna duplicate this part, all I have to do is to use the same command as you use in Pro Tools, which is Command and D. And I'm just gonna copy that to the end of the song. take the click off. Now that's gonna work for the basic songwriting of this song, but I'm gonna be replacing all of these parts later on. And in the next video, I'm gonna show you what it sounds like with all of the parts replaced. I'm Paul from Production Expert. I hope you guys got something out of that and I'll see you next time.